This video will demonstrate how to set up the mouse mode for the GRS Super Joystick and how to adjust the settings within the MAME 2010 emulator for an optimal gaming experience. We'll use the game Ikari Warrior 3 as our test for joystick controls. The game is now up and running. First, press the mode button and joystick button 3 simultaneously for 3 seconds. This switches the joystick to mouse mode, and the indicator light will turn red. Then, press the tab key to access the main menu. From there, navigate to Input, this machine, to begin configuring the joystick and button settings for the game. Let's start by mapping the up, down, left, and right directions of P1 joystick. Then, map the button 1, 2, and 3. Next, this is important, make sure positional analog is set to none. You can set it to none by selecting it and then pressing escape. Now select Positional Analog in. Rotate the knob one notch clockwise and map this clockwise mouse movement in the game. Select Positional Analog Deck. Rotate the knob one notch counterclockwise and map this counterclockwise mouse movement in the game. Next, map the start and coin buttons. Pressing escape to return to the previous page. Navigate to analog controls. Here, ensure that positional increment slash decrement speed is set to zero and positional sensitivity is set to 100. In the testing interface, you can see that the knob's mouse movement has been perfectly matched with the game's rotational controls. Both clockwise and counterclockwise rotations work properly. Press escape to exit the main menu, insert a coin, and start the game. You can see that the character's rotation within the game has been successfully mapped to the joystick. You've now completed the mouse mode setup. Enjoy your game to the fullest.